All right, so this is going to be basically a double Costco sale item review video. Um, this blanket I actually bought a while ago, like several months back. And then this is um, a newer one. I noticed they changed the label. Now it says soft blanket before it said eco soft. So I guess they're trying out things with marketing. Um, the price of this, let me see here. <clears throat> oh, I'm looking at the wrong receipt. Okay, so the price of this, $24.99 for the King Blanket with a $5 discount. So basically $20. Um, and then this one I think was $20 with a $5 discount. So $15. Okay. Um, the material, I don't know if this is, it's sitting for so long. I haven't even unpackaged it. This maybe feels a tiny bit softer. Um, it could also be the coloring. But basically, it looks almost exactly the same packaging material, everything. Okay. Um, they did change stuff a little bit. As you can see, Berkshire Life requires half the water to manufacture. Eco thread, eco dry, uh, eco dry, <laughs> eco dry dye process. Soft blanket, king size, 112 inch by 92 inch, 284 centimeters by 234 centimeters. 1% for the planet. I don't know what that means, why it's saying 1%, but you can see. Earth friendly fabrication, zero water uh, is used in the dyeing process. 50% less water in use is used in production, eco thread. Okay, 1% for the planet. Sale, oh, 1% is donated. Okay, 100% polyester. Machine wash cold, gentle cycle. Separately, use only non-chlorine bleaches. Bleach as needed, tumble dry, no heat. Air or line dry, do not iron. Let me actually put this lower because it's somewhat of a pain to stay in that kneeling up that high. Okay, there you go. <clears throat> paper is packaging. The paper packaging is recyclable. We go text inspiring confidence made in green. I don't know what all that means. Tested for harp harmful substances and produced sustainably in accordance to o Oiko Tex guidelines. And yeah, distributed by Costco. Okay, then they have other languages there. Anyways, let's see how you open this. Can I shove this through? So you can shove the thing through the cardboard ring, I guess. Oh, actually, no, you can't because it's like that, huh? Um, I guess once you push it down, you can actually see there's a Velcro strap here, okay? And then, there we go. So we can take that Velcro out, and we should be able to now take this off. So I guess you can reuse that strap, because it's a Velcro strap. Nice. But if you cut it with scissors, too late. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. We got this cardboard sleeve off, and we can take this out and then now you have a velcro belt you can also reuse the velcro obviously so yeah i don't know i reuse a lot of stuff like that okay it looks like they um used one of those things to kind of those plastic things to hold it together here so we are going to have to snip this i'm gonna have to go get some scissors um and it feels like it's going through multiple layers so that's kind of annoying for now. I'll set this aside. Let's go ahead and look at the queen sized one that I got a long time ago. I think it's the same exact information. You can see 98 inch by 92 inch. I don't know if they changed the size of the queen. Hopefully it's the same. You can see all the rest on the back is the same. 100% polyester, machine wash, cold, gentle cycle separately. Okay, use only non-chlorine bleach. So you do want to wash this separately because you don't know if the color is going to bleed out or not. It did say that they use like a no water, um, no water to dye it. So I don't know how, what they use to dye this fabric, but uh, yeah, I'm assuming this is going to be the same packaging. Let's try and like shove this through. Let's see if we can save that strap like the other one. Okay. And yes, it's the same exact packaging. So they didn't really change much except for the label. Instead of Eco Soft, they called it now, what did they call it? Soft Blanket. <laughs> I guess Eco made it sound like for people, they're like, well, I don't care if it's eco friendly, I just want a soft blanket. So maybe that's what's going on. Okay, same idea, same packaging. They used the thing to hold that in place. 
I kind of hate that because to get to this, I feel like I'm going to snip some of the fabric here. But anyways, this is, I don't know if they still had this color. Um, I think they had a darker blue and a lighter gray. So this is the lighter gray and then the darker blue is a different one. Anyways, let me go get something to cut these and I'll be back. All right, so I'm back. Let's go ahead and cut these things out. So try and move the fabric out as much as you can so you don't accidentally snip it. Get a small bit of this and there we go. Now, okay, here's the other end. It's also difficult to find this piece to like remove it from the material, so that's extra annoying as well. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find that other one, but it'll fall out eventually somewhere. Okay, we'll rotate this. And where is it being held down here? How do we get this out? Okay, so stretch that again. Again, I don't like this. It's like, I feel like it's damaging the blanket, but anyways, get in there and get that. I don't know where the thing went. It disappeared into the blanket. And there we go. Let's zoom out, kind of. All right, we're gonna remove the other one. You can see how it's folded here. Let me actually move this out of the way. So they rolled it like that, rolled it again, rolled it again. Inside of this rolled part, there's a cardboard. Okay, and inside this rolled part, there's also a cardboard somewhere. <laughs> okay. All right, and they just rolled it up like that. So it's folded like this. So it's folded in half, and then it's this side's folded in, and then this is folded here. And actually, this is folded. So it's folded in half. And then it's folded this way, halfway, this way, halfway, and then folded again. Anyways, not that people will care about that. But uh, this blanket is super soft. Yeah, it feels really nice. Okay. The coloring kind of has, you can kind of see like lines on how it's colored. Interesting. I wonder how they do it. But uh, yeah, this blanket is super, super soft i don't know how warm it is yet um let me put this on my lap while i'm opening up the second one and i'll let you know initially um, putting it on is nice and cool we'll see after being in it a while if it retains heat well we're gonna go ahead and cut this one open i really hate this type of packaging see it's actually pulling a thread out right here this one so, I really don't like that. And I don't know how I'm going to get this piece out. <laughs> it's caught in there. There we go. Okay. But yeah, it, it, I don't like how they package it like that. It pulls out a thread, and now we have like this loose piece like hanging out here. Yeah, I don't know. I don't like that. Oh, it looks like they used two on this side. So we're going to cut that one as well. Yeah, I don't I don't like that type of way that they package it. But uh it is what it is. I'll take that piece out. And okay, here's the other one. And where's the I don't know where the other one is. It's missing somewhere inside. It's within the layers. Okay. We'll flip this over. And so far, it's getting nice and warm. Cut this off. Yeah. I don't. I don't like this the way they attach it with those. Okay, I don't know where the other end is. It's probably inside the blanket somewhere. Oh, there it is. Okay. All right, but yeah, it's actually nice and warm. And I'm assuming the packaging for the king-sized one is basically the same. It rolls up like that into multiple things. Okay. Cardboard in this side. And cardboard in this side. I don't know what else to talk about in this uh, video. It's nice and soft. Feels like it'll retain heat pretty well. So if you're cold, this seems like it'll be a nice blanket. Um... Yeah, 
other than that we'll have to wash them see how they hold up actually i noticed this look at this texture so inside has this different different texture which is kind of weird because so i don't know if this design oh actually they're both like that so you can see that the texture is like that it has this more that texture and then this has this so same thing this one has this fluffy texture on this side and then this has this more slick silky texture on this side um, which is kind of weird because when I have other blankets that have like this kind of texture this is what it looks like after I've used it for a while <laughs> and and then like oils get in it or whatever and you wash it and it basically stays this way so I don't know but it does have it does feel like this side is warmer than this side so yeah I think yeah so interesting so this side is actually warmer and this side's a little bit cooler so I guess you can have two different types of blankets for different types of weather um, I don't know if it's all in my head but that's the way it feels to me this feels maybe because it's more slick more smooth feels cooler and this feels more like cottony fabricy yeah um, not much else to say about that hopefully you guys find these at your Costco and enjoy them um, they seem like really nice blankets we'll see what happens when I wash them uh, because I do need to eventually wash them but yeah other than that thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one bye